for years I have been talking about how there's a crisis level shortage of foster homes in Whatcom County and how we desperately need uh, more people to become foster parents. And I've been working hard to drive home that point by sharing with you the gripping true stories of the men and women doing the work by trying to demystify the process and, and describing the traits of excellent foster parents. And all of that um, has paid off. And now we have a different situation, a situation that we've never experienced before at Skookum. Um, we have a waiting list for families wanting to care only for children younger than three. That is, today, there are six families, trained, licensed, ready to go, who are only interested in caring for children three years old and younger. They are ready, their home is ready, and there aren't any zero, one, two, three-year-olds in need of a foster home. So, uh, together, we wait. This is great news. We've never had this before. Um, it's kind of a mission accomplished moment, um, and it's also a new challenge because there are still children in need of foster homes uh, in our community, but just not in that specific age range. So our posture is gonna have to change a little. Instead of talking so much about why you should be a foster parent generally, we'll spend some time talking about why you should be a foster parent to older children and youth specific. All that general foster care stuff we spent the last four years on, all that's still true. Uh, but the situation here in our community is um, just a little different today. If you're only interested in caring for a single very young child, um, you're going to wait in line for a while. There's plenty of help in that area. But if you are open to an older child um, or a teenager, there's still a lot of need in those areas. So. You know, if you have questions about what it might be like to care for a school-aged child or a teenager in need of a foster home, we'd love to hear from you. Skookumkids.org slash foster care. And you know, um, this is a big moment. I think it marks an important transition in the life of Skookum and the, the history of foster care in our community. Um, when we created a surplus in the number of foster homes, willing to care for a particular subset of children. Still work to do in other areas, but that's, um, that's big.